is up you guys it is me wacky rambo here and i'm here with another minecraft video today i'm gonna show you guys some cool stuff with redstone which includes how to make a couple of like redstone just like testing things i don't really know how to call them i would say i'd say like clocks um musical notes and I will call it the spin block because it is cool I just need to connect these yay you see that yeah that's pretty cool it's pretty interesting I mean it's a little spinning block right there um it um it's pretty good I would say I like it a lot Oh, wait, I need to try something. Okay. Ah, that's cool. That's what my friend likes to do. Like, he made that wall to see how much he can get through. If you saw my, um, some automatic TNT cannon video, you know what this is. Um, you wanna go check it out? Just go check out my channel. Or, I can just have a link to the semi-automatic TNT can tutorial in the description if you want to go check it out. So basically, let's get started at the moment. I have this wooden axe, which was for world edit, because I'm on my server and it has plugins and stuff. But really, we're just going to go and do some basic stuff. So first, we're going to do a clock. There are many ways of doing a clock. Like, if you've seen my arrow cannon tutorial... You might have seen how it goes tick, 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 and that's why I guess we, the um, Minecrafters call it a clock and stuff. But I'm going to clear my inventory just so we can get started from the beginning. I'm actually going to change something so you guys can see some stuff better. No, too much. No, it's just fine. I'm a, I'll keep it there. Why is it so hard to scroll? I just want to scroll. Scroll. Okay, whatever. I'll keep it there. Oh no, a friend joined. Okay. Hey. Okay. Oh, by the way, guys, I type a little bit faster than in my first videos. No. Oh. <laughs> He's gonna be surprised by this. I got out of school by 10.30 today because it was snowing. And, well, it, it started to snow. It was, like, super small. And, yeah, and stuff. So, I just kind of made this bigger so you guys can see a little bit more. So, you're obviously going to need redstone. You're going to need, um, uh, um, <laughs> yeah, sorry. He's just asking me some stuff, so I want to be with you guys. Well, I'm not actually with you guys, and that'd be kind of creepy. So, not really. Okay, so you're going to need redstone, redstone repeater, and a redstone torch. You're also going to need a normal piston. And, well, for now, you're going to need... Well, actually, for now, all you're going to need is this. And a normal block, like stone, I'll say. Um, we're going to make the clock right now. So the first clock that we can make is this one. It's a pretty simple clock. You kind of connect it around like this. And then do that. And just add it at the top. No, what? Why didn't it work? It didn't work. Why did it not work? Is it lagging? There we go. There we go. Sorry. There we go. It's working. So it's going tick, tick, tick. And the cool thing you can do with this is like if you have a dispenser and you have tons and tons of arrows, you can add a dispenser. Like this is kind of what I use for my arrow gun. No, what happened to my arrows? No. You can add in your arrows and connect it. And it'll do that. And it'll be awesome. I'm gonna waste that whole thing. 
Um, yeah, so that's pretty cool. I'm just going to collect it all. Yeah, it's over. That's actually kind of short. So, just take this off and break it. So, that's the first clock I'm going to show you guys. I need that. What the heck? Oh, there we go. So, that's the first clock I'll show you guys. Um, I'll also show you the next one, which is, I would say, pretty easy. You need to rest some repeaters. You put one repeater facing this way, then the other one this way. You can get... And then you just put your, you know, your redstone around it. And then I honestly like to use a lever for this. I, I do it easily. You gotta turn it off and just turn it off instantly. You gotta turn the redstone on and off instantly. So kind of like do this. And then add it instantly. Take it off and add it quickly. And it'll be a clock. See, lots of times the clock will lag. But since this doesn't have like torches and stuff it doesn't make that noise or you know kind of like if smoke is coming out or something so that's another clock i like this one it's a little bit easier and there's another one that's actually a lot bigger you can use it's it's i don't i would say i don't really see what the difference is if you guys know the difference then maybe you can put it down in the comments but it's basically the same oh i don't want that it's basically the same just no just a lot more maybe it's a lot more it's less laggy you could say but it's going around like that and slower slower pace because there are more repeaters and stuff okay so I'm sorry the chat <coughs> <coughs> I'm making a video, dude. Ah, ah, man. You gotta wait, dude. It's kind of hard. Oh, whatever. His attic sucks anyway. No, I'm kidding. His attic is actually, um, except he has this really big house. It's actually a long house. It's really simple. And he wanted it to make it bigger, so I gave you this attic with, like, Super small attic with like bookshelves and stuff. A bunch of pigs got into it, which was kind of funny. Yeah, so those are some of the clocks you can add. Those are the ones I really know right now. So if you guys know any more, you can just leave them down in the comments. You can put a link to a video or something. If you want to show me more, you know you don't have to. But if you guys have any questions about that, you can tell me. So let's move on to musical notes. Now currently... For this, you are going to need stone, um, wooden planks, and which is, and dirt, or grass. So, it's kind of cool, because if you check this out, that kind of makes a piano noise. Kind of makes a drum noise. It's kind of like this. This is piano. That's kind of drums. No, this is piano, sorry. And this is bass. Yeah, sorry. I should know that. I play the bass. I should know that. Stupid me. Okay, so that's basically it. Um, Now, if you if you have a normal note block, oh, uh, yeah, you guys are going to need note blocks, redstone, redstone repeaters, and a lever or a button to activate. Repeaters, stupid me. So, you guys are wondering... See, they all kind of make the same thing. The reason is that the block under it changes the tone by a lot. So if you look under, he has normal grass there. Grass there. What? Up oh, there. Oh, he has two of the same right there. Let me show you. Right there. Wood. This one grass. And then this one wood. Okay, he's confusing me. I'll show you mine. It's, it's, I guess it explains better. He was showing me some of this stuff, my friend Peaback27. <coughs> um, see, here. The stone makes um, a bass drum noise. Kind of like bass drum. This is the bass, which would be the wood. And normal dirt is piano. So basically what I will show you to do is maybe a basic beat, you can say. 
So how we're gonna make this? It's um, it you really if you've ever looked up like top five or top ten creations or something, the top five creations of Minecraft by Machinima, or if you just look like up no nope, blocks and stuff, what they do? That's what they use. Um. They'll use repeaters to give it the timing, so it'll be like one done, and then they'll add more timing to the repeater, and then it'll go again. So you time it with the repeater, basically. So right now, let's just put down the main blocks. Whoops, I'll read it. Let me just put down another one here. So we're gonna put down our note blocks here: bass drum, ah, uh, bass drum, piano, bass. <coughs> so, what I would do is I would just break the block. Since this is all grass, you can just leave it the same. But with this, you depending how long you want all the note blocks to be and stuff, you'll just add it on for a while. You know, um, I'll add them up kind of the same with the stone. Ah, lucky I already had stone there. So you just want to, you know, make it as long as you want, really. And then, you know, just keep going. And here. So each one block you're gonna put, um, uh, you're gonna put a note block. And really, lots of times you might be wondering this, where um, when you hit a note block, it'll make one noise. But if you hit it again, it'll make a different note. But with this, when the redstone hits, if it's on the same note, it'll always play that note. So if I hit it right now, it goes on that note. Usually, if you hit it again, it will change note. But with the redstone, it'll it'll play the same note every time. Every time, sorry. Same one. It's only if you hit it that it'll change the note. So I'll just change that so it'll go back to the default sound, or you know the first note. And just add it up on all of them. Just you know, same. Just every block. You can just do it like this. Well, you don't need to do it every block, but I choose it every block if you're going to make a straight pattern, you know. This is an easy tutorial for you guys. So, over here you ha you just add in your repeaters facing forward, depending which way is forward for you. Um, forward. Yeah, no more. Forward. 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 Jump. Back down. Ah, oh, no, stupid. Forward, forward, and you know, so on. So you just keep it going, and that's basically it. Well, we're not done yet. Then you wanna, oh no, and you can set them at different ticks if you want, like a different rhythm or pattern. So if you hit it, see that? Wait, that's weird. The last notes on those over there since I was demonstrating. See, even though it hits it again, it'll play the same note. So let me just change it back for you guys. Oh, is he still there? I have bad connection on my own server. Wow. That's not what I wanted. So, look. Oh, it's that last one. Sorry guys, just no. There we go. That last base was making bad noise. Okay, here we go. So just check that. You now they all have the same one. So you have that nice tone. And if you want to make the second block a different tone, you hit it again. And you all add them up once. Yeah, so that's kind of how it goes. So now each one will have a different note if you see it. Like that. Kind of go up scale. Um, and you can also change it. So w with the repeaters, you'll change the timing. So you can do this one like that. Maybe then do second on this one. And then just, you know, like keep the 
pattern going, and then on this one, just, you know, you know, do whatever you want. You can make your own music with this, which is pretty cool. Um, it's obviously not going to be professional music, because you only have, like, three instruments. So, this is kind of basic right here. So, yeah, so, see, it kind of changed the pattern. Da dun dun da dun dun. That was it. Da 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 dun da dun dun da da dun da dun dun da dun. So even a guy made the nyan cat sound on this, which is very cool. Pa. Da 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 da. Yeah, so that's it. And now I'm gonna show you. The block wheel. I will call it the block spin. Huh. So this will be a part one, actually. Well, this will be like um um episode one of Redstone of Redstone utilities or like Redstone tools, because there will probably be a lot more stuff I can teach you. So I'm gonna show you how to do this. Now that is very cool. I love that. So let me just clear my inventory here for you guys, so we can start over. You will need a normal piston, redstone, redstone repeater, redstone torch, and a, whichever block you want. I'll use stone. Ooh, actually, I have a cool idea. I will use a sponge or glass. I'll use glass. Decisions, 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 if you know what I mean. Okay. Oh, no. Did I forget? I forgot the piston. I'm stupid. So, piston, no. Piston, then piston. So this is how, how this works is, oh, and I'll need your redstone down here in the middle. So how this works is you'll give your blocks like this. You know what, I'm, I'm just gonna, you know. You'll put your blocks like this. No, wait, wrong way, sorry. See, this will just go from the. So you'll put your block out like this and then down this way. Like that. And same with this side. You'll put your repeater here. And from this side, get your redstone coming out. You can do the same on this side. Now, here we go. Oh, now he's AFK. Okay, whatever. So, and then you just want to keep that pattern going on all sides. And then you just do this. Now, I think the last step is just take your block. <gasps> what has happened? Oh, I see what happened. I think that's the only problem. What is going on? You guys know what's going on. Let me try a different block. Is th I, th If that's why, that'd be stupid. Oh my god. It was because it was glass. Okay. So apparently you can't use glass. Sadly. But that's basically to, and to stop you. You just want to cut out one piece of redstone. You and um, so that's basically it. It's just kind of like a loop. And once you put that block there, the redstone hits the block and activates this, pushes this, pushes this, you know, keeps the whole thing going. Very cool. It's fun to play around with. Looks like that, 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 that. And you can even make a competition, it's like try and break the block while it moves. Rawr! See, I can't do it. Rawr! I can't do it. I did it! Yes. Oh, what? What the? Yeah. What? Did you see that? Look. Oh, I was. Oh, what? What? Do you see that? Do you see that? That is absurd. That is absurd. Oh, there we go. I did it. <laughs> that is absurd. So, um, that was really it, guys. Um, uh, leave a comment down below if you guys want anything. Else, and if you guys don't really leave anything because I don't have that much viewers or subscribers, then I'll just go ahead and make an, an episode two and stuff like that. So, I hope you guys enjoyed and you learned some redstone experiencing here. And I shall see you guys next time. Well, I won't see you because that would just be weird.
you have to get famous to actually see people. But you know. So, hope you guys, if you guys enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. That really help. If you didn't like it, well, you know, you choose what to do right there. Um, comment down below if you have any questions, things you didn't like about it or any or something, and some some stuff I can improve. And you know, like just keep it clean down there. You know, um, don't try and put too much mean stuff in there. I mean, but you know. So, and if you really want to get some more of these Minecraft videos, like Minecraft mod showcases, um, tutorials like this, gameplay of CTF, you know, that kind of Hunger Games stuff, then just click that red subscribe button. So, thanks, thank you guys for watching, and I shall catch you guys up with new videos. I'll try and keep them going every week at least. If not, every couple of days. So, yeah. So, thanks for watching, guys. Bye.